four was True. good, but it was silly. I'll take well, silly over delusion flop, any day of the week. And Black Ops 2 is the second biggest flop. But this game outranks Modern Warfare in almost every single no. aspect except for talking. What is up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to the channel. Hope you're having a great day today. Uh, the gameplay you're watching is some snipers only gameplay, and that's what I wanted to talk about in the video. It's actually been a while since I've actually shown some Black Ops Cold War footage slash talked about it on the channel. You know, we had a you know a brief pause with that because I talked about Black Ops 4, talked about a Titanfall 2, and obviously showed those gameplays. And by the way, thank you so much for the support on those. I always get really nervous whenever I you know upload a different title slash gameplay, and I'm like, it's like, are people gonna watch? Are people gonna unsubscribe? And people, you know, so far who've been watching it, a lot of you guys have been very kind to me uh in terms of views likes comments so i appreciate that you know i don't know if you guys are okay seeing different content or whatever uh but i, I did want to you know give you guys kind of my thoughts on black ops cold war a little bit again and the main reason for that is because we have this new mode i don't know how new it is by the time you're watching this but it is a snipers only mode and so with that you cannot use lethals and tacticals as you can see in the gameplay here and you can only use snipers you can't pull out a pistol i you can punch i think that's the only thing that's like annoying about this and I kind of just wanted to talk about, you know, my thoughts on this mode and, you know, some changes I'd like to see and just overall, is it fun? Should you play it? All that kind of stuff. So if you're into it, leave a like on the video, subscribe if you're new and let's jump into it. Right off the bat, I just have to say that snipers only is not for everyone, right? If you're bad at sniping, if you don't have great aim uh, with a sniper or if you're just not a quick scoper or, you know, you just don't like hard scoping or whatever, it's not for everyone, okay? So I'm not trying to convince people who are, you know, complete rushers with SMGs or something to snipe, and I'm not convincing, you know, LMG campers to run around quick scoping. That's not the intent of this video. It's it's mainly just to kind of express my thoughts. Do I like it? Is it fun? Is it not fun? And right off the bat, I have to say, it's pretty fun. Honestly, this mode eliminates a lot of the random BS in the game. Uh, a lot of nade spam, stuff like that is, is gone. Uh, it's just aim. It's just, can you aim faster than me? Uh, and it's not even just like who can see each other first. It's because sometimes that's what's like annoying about Call of Duty. It's just like, oh, he saw me first and he has, you know, I don't know, no recoil gun. So he's going to kill me easily. With a sniper, you have to aim. You have to be pretty dang good. If you're like on 1v1 or something like that, like just face each other right off the bat you have to aim you have to be able to hit your shot and uh, if you come across a bad lobby like i wouldn't say this lobby that we're in is bad and by the way we is is in the mob you know playing with i think jb difo chef nut some other people uh, maybe deserves in here i don't even know and i think you know with a full squad even alone it's pretty fun depending on the lobby of course you can say that about any mode but uh, i don't know when you when you face a team that just like not can't snipe but isn't as good as you let's say it's pretty dang fun, you know what I mean? Like, I just think it's fun because you can destroy people. You know, I've seen people get massive streaks. I think I dropped a harp in this gameplay. You know, like, when's the last time I dropped a harp in, in just like regular multiplayer or whatever? You know, you never see me dropping a harp. So I don't know, I just think it's fun. I think it's fast paced, it's fluid. And the biggest thing I like about it is that a lot of the BS is gone. Like I said, no C4s, no, you know, random cruise missiles at the end of the game that just randomly kill you. However, speaking about streaks, it is weird how there are lethal streaks allowed. Like, I think you can use a sentry gun, but you can't use a war machine. And I think you can use a cruise missile, but not like a napalm or something like that. It's it's very weird how the streaks are set up in this game mode. I don't know if it was just not playtested. That wouldn't surprise me if, you know, a mode <laughs> wasn't playtested, especially in the pandemic. And just with, uh, you know, what else has been going on with Cold War recently, how, you know, they're super busy with stuff. But moving on into the negatives of this mode, uh, something I don't like is that there's no stim shot and there's nothing that kind of stops you from punching. I think, uh, you know, somewhere along the gameplay here, you can see I do circles with someone and I end up punching them. I, I try not to punch because I think it's kind of cheesy, but you know, worst comes to worst, you're out of bullets or whatever, you kind of have to punch, right? I think punching needs to be removed. I think stim shot needs to be in the game. I think a lot of the, you know, lethal streaks need to be out of the game. I don't know what they're doing in here. Like, why can some people earn a sentry gun, but I don't have a Semtex and I can't use a rocket launcher to take it out? Like, what am I supposed to do about that you know what i mean i don't know if it's a glitch i don't know if they're getting these from care packages or whatever but uh something needs to happen about that because that's just like i'm not shooting a sentry gun or like punching it a million times and someone's gonna sneak up and kill me that's that's just not gonna happen okay that's not fun and so now that we're nearing kind of the end of the commentary here i just want to talk about 
I think Cold War needs to have stuff like this, just fun game modes that just alleviate you of all the BS. Another game mode that I really want to see that was in Black Ops 4 was the Mercenary Mosh Pit. I think that was so much fun because it alleviates the heavy skill based matchmaking, it alleviates, you know, you having to deal with parties all the time. It's just, it's super annoying. Even like two or three players who are just good together, that's not fun. You know what I mean? I don't want to deal with a bunch of players working together who are also good. That's, that's not fun. And obviously with Cold War's SBMM system, you're going to run into that if you're a good player more often than not, right? If you'd have to reverse boost if you didn't want to run into that. And so make a game mode where people don't have to reverse boost. Make freaking mercenary mosh pit. Like I, I don't understand why that's so hard. I think other commentators talked about that in the past as well, but you know, a lot of game modes are really good from Black Ops 4. This bare bones snipers is pretty much one of them. I also really liked, like I said, the mercenary. I think there could be one just called bare bones with no streaks, no lethal tacticals. Like that would be cool. Pretty much like this, but you don't have to use a sniper. Just straight gunfight on gunfight action. Like I think that would be pretty dope too. I think there's just so many like cool ideas that they could do in this game that they haven't for some reason, at, at least not yet. You know, maybe they will in the future, maybe not. But yeah, I don't know. I just wanted to talk about this a uh, pretty short commentary. I don't have a lot else to say. I really enjoy this. You know, as you can see in the gameplay here, as it, it pretty much rounds up, uh, I go pretty much 28 and 12, which is a pretty good score for using a sniper, at least in my opinion. Uh, and I dropped a harp. So what else can you ask for in like a, what is this TDM, I think? So with all that being said, again, I just want to thank you guys for the support. You know, you guys have been joining Discord, Twitter, Twitch, all that stuff. Speaking of Twitch, I got new sub badges, uh, emotes, stuff like that. I've ramped up my Twitch a lot, so it's going to be more engaging, more exciting, and hopefully I will see you guys there. I'm going to try to Discord post my uh, Twitch schedule every like week or something so you guys know when and what to look forward to. But, but yeah, that'll be coming out at some point soon. So hopefully you enjoyed the video. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you did and if you're new. And go ahead and leave a comment down below. Do you enjoy the sniper's mode? Do you not enjoy it? What do you like? What do you dislike about it? And uh, just leave me all that thoughts in the comment section down below, as well as if you have any specific topics you'd like to see me talk about. It doesn't even necessarily have to be Call of Duty related. It could just be like gaming news related or whatever. And, you know, I'll consider it. So I really appreciate the support, like I said, and uh, hope you guys have a great day. Thanks for watching. Peace out.